Hello, hello. Are we live? <laughs> am I alive? I hope I am. Well, guys, welcome to Life is Strange. We are going to do Bay over Bay today. So, oh, there we go. Hi. Hi, Akua. <laughs> I am live and alive, hooray. Thank you for the confirmation. Hey, hey everybody. Hey Catherine, hey Michelle, hey Brittany. All right, confirmation that I am alive. Great, thank you guys very much. <laughs> All right, life is strange. Oh, it's so nice to be back in Arcadia Bay. It's been ages. I just, I've missed this music and everything. So the plan is today that we are going to Make Chloe our boo. Oh, hi, Riley. Thanks for joining. Yeah, so we're going to save her life this time and sacrifice Arcadia Bay. And I'm also going to do some different things than I did the first time. Oh, hi, Kendra. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoy the videos. Um, yeah. So we are going to start a new game. We're gonna try some different stuff, some make some major changes just to see what exactly what changes there are. I'm 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 kind of not clear exactly how much difference there is between choices. Yes, hashtag save the bay. What Riley said. Let's get into it. Get back into this game. So excited. How's everybody doing today? By the by. Ah. Also, let me know if the audio levels are too loud for either the game or myself. I'll try and fix that if it is. Right now, this thunderstorm sounds hella loud in my ears. Where am I? What's happening? I'm trapped Glad in the storm. Doing fantastic writing. How did I get here? I'm good. I'm and just where is here? Wait, there's the lighthouse. I'll be okay. safe if I Volume's can make it there. A little bit loud. Okay, I will change I that hope. in a second. Please let me make it there. Sounded a little bit wee loud. Let's see. Audio settings. Let's try. All right. I don't know. Something like that? All right. We'll try that for now. Let me know if that sounds a little bit better, if I should turn it down even more. coffee before this. Probably not a good idea when you're nervous to drink a bunch of caffeine, but hey. Okay, what? Well, okay. I hope I, you can hear me a little bit better now. That monster. Holy shit. Whoa! No! Whoa. That was so okay. surreal. Glad the volume is better. Little pieces of time. Thank you, Riley, very much. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, hey, Catherine. Okay, I'm good. In class. good. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light You're not to okay. Shadow. You're in Mark Jefferson's class. From color to chiaroscuro. Oh, now, okay. can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep. 
And that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane Arbus. <laughs> there you go, Victoria. Uh, Why Arbus? Because right. of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. I saw... She saw humanity as tortured, right? Hello? And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. All right, just a second. I am going to go through all this so it marks as red. I'm not going to read this journal entry again because I read it the first time through. I could frame um, any one of you in a dark corner. But I will look at it later. So I'm sure Max is going to write some different things that we haven't seen before. Uh, hi, North Country Ladybug. Thank you very much. I'm glad you were able to make it to the stream today. Capture you in a moment of desperation. Why can I not? And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? <laughs> too obvious? Yeah, I What if Arbus do... chose to... Look at this crap. What? <laughs> How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? That is I can so hear weird. the class laughing at me now. I had to look for a brief second, and then... It just wouldn't do it, so I just kind of dragged the mouse as if it was highlighted, and it worked. Yay! I guess. <laughs> um, okay, whatever. Capture people at the height of their beauty or innocence. Why? She had a brilliant eye. What is... So, she could have taken another approach. What is going on with I have to admit, with the I'm not a big fan of her work. UI right now. I prefer um, Robert Frank. Hold on a second. Something... Something screwy is going on. Um, sh sh maybe. I don't know if that'll help. Let's see. Confirm that for now. Me too, Victoria. Why is it doing this? He captured this the essence of post-war beat America. And there was honesty about the economic conditions Anybody of the have any idea why it's but doing a beauty that? in the struggle. I have to, like, look through maps. You, you don't have beauty without a beat. Which explains why Frank was Kerouac's photographic muse. And both were the great chroniclers of the 1950s. Well, we've all seen that iconic shot of Kerouac on the balcony. I guess it's perfect for my portfolio. Shame, and I have to get my daily selfie quota. I'm kind of just dragging and stuff. Now, to make contrast it go. Frank's stark Americana. Shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. Oh gosh, I hope this A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images yeah, for I might restart selfie the game. expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture see, has the, always the been a vital over, aspect I'll, of art uh, and photography for as long as it's been around. I'll see if maybe it fixed itself. If it has, now, Max, then I might have to restart. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth please. to the first self-portraits? Don't even please, Mark Jefferson. Um, I did know. I did know. But I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Okay, at least the dialogue. Is there anybody thing here who knows time. their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp, reflective style, like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. <laughs> no, the Daguerrean process it. brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely so popular so from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. Otherwise, I will have to restart. Sorry, guys. You can find out all about him in your textbook or even you can read. online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. <laughs> Shut up, Mark. Don't look at me, man. Okay. We're moving. Now Victoria it's... doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Okay. Well, poo. All right, I'm going to try one 
Oops, that's the wrong one. I'm gonna try one more thing before I restart. Let's see if there's anything. Um, uh, I don't know if that does anything. Sorry guys, gotta play around with this. No. I'll be quiet, Victoria. <laughs> Thanks, Catherine. I appreciate the understanding. Yeah, unfortunately, like, the first stream is going to be basically me floundering around trying to get things to to work. So. Let's see if we can't figure this out. I've never seen this before. This is so, so weird, and I keep pressing the wrong button. Um, all right, reset the default. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah. I might as well put it back to, whoops, what it was before. Ah, uh, da, da, da. Okay. Confirm and exit. And then we're going to exit to main menu. Okay, first. I'm gonna press continue and see if just reloading. Whoa! Well, save. that was so oh, surreal. Oh, really? We have to listen to the whole thing again? No! <laughs> but he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. This is just like episode five all over cool. again. <laughs> I'm okay. Except I'm doing From it to myself. To shadow. Ugh. From color to chiaroscuro. <sighs> now. Can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep. And that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane Arbus. There you go, Victoria. It's Why Arbus? It's still not working. Because of her images of hopeless faces. Good. You feel like totally hot. Okay. Unfortunately, we're going to have to listen to that whole spiel again. <laughs> <laughs> Catherine, don't laugh at me. I'm having problems. <laughs> Okay, let's try that again. Let's go, let's go, come on. Otherwise, this, um, this stream's gonna take a little longer. <laughs> I'm just teasing Catherine, it's totally fine. It is, it is funny. Because, you know, of course, it would happen, right? <laughs> uh, message retracted. Oh, yeah. Um, no, you don't. No, don't worry, Cat. I am totally teasing. You do not have to apologize. Not at all. You're good. <laughs> Thank you, Akua. Uh, okay, let's try this again. Whoa! That was so surreal. Famously called film, Little Pieces of Time. Uh, I don't know if I got this. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. <laughs> okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I'm okay. From light to shadow. I feel like Max right now. From color to chiaroscuro. Cool. I'm okay. Now. Can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane Arbus. Oh no. There you go, Victoria. Why, Why Arbus? Why is it doing because this? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad... Okay. I'm gonna pause it. Let's see if I... I'm gonna do a quick Google search, guys. Just bear with me for a second. Uh, life is strange. Um, how do I even begin to Google this? Um, I can't select. Uh, can't see to select. Yeah, can't see options of objects. There we go. That's a better way to put it. Um, can't see them. Can see them when Max is in front of the object. You need to decrease the screen size in the options 
Change the screen size until it's fixed. Okay. Yeah, Brittany, I've never... Like, this never happened the entire time that I played before. Um, let's see. Settings. Um, video settings. So I need to change... Whoa. The screen size. Let's see. Excellent. Mothers and children. Oh, she fixed. saw humanity as tortured, oh, right? Oh my god, that is such an easy fix. And frankly, fix. it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Okay. Unfortunately, the other... Now I have another problem. <laughs> uh, hey, Pats. Thanks for coming. Uh, I need to... Grief. I can't get my OBS back up. It won't let me exit out of here. Hold on. I need to exit one more time. I think it's working now. I just need to get my OBS back up so I can make sure I'm actually recording what's on the screen. Sorry, guys. Okay, once that's up, play? I think we all knew a girl like Victoria <laughs> growing up. Unless we were the Victoria. Hmm. But yeah, I knew a girl like Victoria too. That's why she rubs me the wrong way a lot of times. But I also feel sad for her. Alright, I think we've got this. Okay, so OBS is back. You can see. I'm all seeing now. Both in game and out of game. Hopefully this will be the last time we have to hear Mark Jefferson go blah, 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 blah. We can just move on with our lives. Whoa. That was so Alfred surreal. Hitchcock famously called film little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. Yeah, no. I'm okay. We're good. From light to shadow. Well, at least, From color you know what, guys? To cure if skill. you, uh... Now, Ever had that problem can you give me an strange? example of now a photographer know. who perfectly captured the human Resize condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane oh. Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why it's Arbus? Working. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? Because of her images of I can hear the class laughing at me now. Totally if anybody else looked at this, okay. what would they think? But you have a hella cool journal, Max. Okay, so it saved us looking at everything, but it didn't... By the eyes of those right. sad mothers and children. Well, whatever. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to your... Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call... I got Mark with the double... Selfie, shh, shh, shh. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. <clears throat> Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I did know, but I, I know kind it's of Louise forgot. de Guerre. You either so know this time, or but... not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis de Guerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Yeah, now yeah. you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. <laughs> the daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, I'm wondering making if them my extremely chat popular has from the 1800s sucked. onward. The first American yeah, daguerreotype self-portrait was done by times. Robert Cornelius. Fix that you can next. find out all about him in your textbook or even I'll online. Wait till this is done and then fiddle hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Look, Mark, I've got problems of my own right now. <laughs> so if you could stop yelling at me, it'd be great. Okay. 
Let's let's see. I need to pop out chat. Okay, let's just put that over there, kind of. Okay. Um, and let's see. I need to put that back up and there. Okay, yeah, that seems to have fixed it. Hey, Sarah Grace, you're procrastinating. Good job, girl. <laughs> I'm all about the procrastination. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Oh, it's so nice to be able to see again. Okay, so I'm not gonna look at anything in here because this nothing's been changed so by myself yet. So, but I will talk to Kate, of course. I just really Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. Event. And I want to represent Blackwell Academy. Um, you, just by by yeah, you seem quiet today. Seem quiet today. Now, no just thinking wins. too much. This is just a bump on a bigger road. I don't want anybody to feel I still don't know what that process, is. That's, that's such a weird thing to, to say. This photographic world is Maybe we're talking about everybody. the... I had my moment in the camera. The, um, contest? Everybody oh. I think Victoria has already won the contest. Yeah. As usual. She's got nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me too. Talk to you later. Sure. I wish we had said to get a cup of tea, but part of what I was hinting at earlier about changing some things is... Now I wish I wouldn't have read if this. If you're familiar with the... Uh, Purge. The end of episode two. Gonna make a big change there. All right, let's take a photo. All right. Let's see. Um, do I talk? I guess I need to talk to him because he's just going to call me back. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Uh, I didn't have any time. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Okay. Thanks, Mark. By the way, if someone would just... wouldn't mind saying, like, hey, or test in chat in the next couple of minutes, I'd appreciate it. Just, some, just so that I know it's actually working again, because... I you didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I feel like you have to pass you it. Welcome to the real world. Just cute. Hot. Huh. Then I might send you a special picture. What's the point of Because Max wants everybody to see how he is. I'm not paying $150. Would you please it so shy? I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Thank you, Brittany and Catherine. Okay, I just wanted to make sure I don't look like a total loser. Did I actually fix chat? Okay, it is fixed. Don't feel like you need to chat constantly, by the way. <laughs> I just wanted to make sure it is still working. She's so fucking shy. Excellent. And hey, even with all the technical snafus and stuff, I made it to the title screen faster than I did when I played it through the first time. Hooray! If that's not a cause for celebration, I don't know what is. Alright, we're not gonna look at all y'all guys. We've done that before. We're gonna make our way swiftly to the bathroom. American and hopefully not get copyright stri stricken by the music. Imagine a world without Take your earbuds out quick, Max. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Good girl. Yay, except for me. <sighs> Phew. Okay. 
We're here to wash our face. Illuminati. There's the fire bell. Get ready for that in a little bit. Um, let me just... What pictures do we need again? Skateboard, blah, 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 blah. Okay. I am still going to take some pictures because that's who we are. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. <laughs> Quotation. Fuck it. Fuck my gift. <laughs> when a door closes, ah, a window opens. Light. Or something like that. The electric blue. Okay, girl, light. you don't get a photo op like this every day. Hello, yeah. Nathan, Nathan, Nathan. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. Oh, boy. All right. Gotta say, So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control uh, me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! And so it begins. Reverse, reverse. Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I never noticed I that she actually hand. cried there. And then I was back here. When she comes back. Maybe my potato computer couldn't render the tear back then. Lecture. From light to shadow. That's pretty neat though. From color she actually was now Kate is there. being hassled again. And if Victoria's huh. phone rings, this is real. Interdusting. Now, Shit. can you give me an example of a Damn, photographer? I cannot believe who this. Captured the human condition in black and white. I love that she smashes it and okay. nobody reacts. Okay, if I'm crazy, I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Diane. Can I actually reverse time? There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Yes, you can. <laughs> Let's do the time warp again. <laughs> exactly. I did now, it. Can you give I me actually did it. A photographer I did who perfectly captured I'm a human, the human time machine. And black and white. I Anybody? love how Max just accepts it immediately. Bueller? Max, don't Diane. freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition, and Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming course, this. As you all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. Time travel confirmed. What if that girl isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? The portraiture has always been a vital aspect yeah, girl, of art and photography. Yeah, girl, we gonna do it this time. I need to go to the bathroom Once quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. I have to use the bathroom. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. 
We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after Melissa class. And I need time to save that girl. Types? A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. I got actually attention to what totally Victoria stuck said. In the metro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? All right, tutorial. Yeah, there we go. Hold shift. Now, Max. The Daguerrean process, sir. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process <laughs> made portraiture hugely so popular, <laughs> mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. <laughs> and guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Will do. But first, yes. I'm talking Victoria, to Kate again. To nice answer, Max. Even are you okay? You look pale. Kate, class, um, did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? So I'm sorry, just I'm just tripping. You know like Too much stress. I know the feeling. I just really think everyday heroes is an important I wish we didn't. Event. I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. I love you, Kate. I'm sorry for what I'm gonna do to you later. I don't want anybody to feel excluded from this process, but I also- Excuse me. Excuse Mr. Jefferson, me, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of a- I'm just not sure. Yeah, you know what? I'm not avoiding. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Wanna. Waiting for the elusive right moment? Yeah, biding exactly. time. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Press control. I mean, I don't know why I want to impress my teacher, but... Of course I'm going to abuse my powers. This process, but... I also want everybody to know- Excuse me. Let one of the John Lennon once said- I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. I love that she gets time travel powers and immediately starts abusing them for her own personal gain. So funny. <laughs> I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't run? tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Got no time for music today. Let's go. You know I don't tease. I hate that science class with those nerds. Okay, Max, retrace every step. It's okay, I didn't make you look at everything, so you don't have to look face. at everything. Just have to wash your face. I shredded my photo. Then the Butterfly flew in, and I took a photo. I wouldn't say it's bad, Michelle. He does have really nice glasses, to be Leave fair. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down! Tell me what to do. I'm I so need a hammer to break it open. I know, but I can look at it you first so that you know to move. Hella more trouble for this than drugs. Can Nobody I Nobody would this? ever okay. even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Ah. Oh. Holy shit, I can't let this happen. Hella more trouble if I can reverse time again, I can help her. I got you, miss girl. Your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak! Woohoo! Yeah, there, girl. Another shitty day. <laughs> that line is so funny. That did not happen. This happens all the time. It's just another shitty day. 
I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. Hi. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. I never noticed before that the butterflies stayed here. Hi, Yummy Anna! I'm so glad you're able to make it. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face oh, is covered David in Matt. guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, huh? Mr. Madsen. Huh? The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. <laughs> Growl. Alright, I'm just gonna leave. Bye, uh, Principal. Do, 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 do. Hold on, Max. Come back here. I know, the nostalgia's real. <laughs> oh, it's so nice. You look a little stressed it. out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. Yeah, you're right sweating now. pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is Great. that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Sheesh. Okay, now I do remember. I think I think I did report him the first time I played through, and Chloe wasn't happy about it. So I'm going to hide the truth this time. I just got sick in class. Um, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Agreed. Jefferson's class. Just Love tell David. me what you're hiding. Brittany. You can He's trust a great me. Character. There's nothing to hide. Very well. I got written. sick. It happens, you know. There's yeah, that no. teen toot again. You know, I've I've heard enough. <laughs> don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only you been here know. for three weeks and you're already causing conflict. Well, I don't I think mean. your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with class. Please. <laughs> she looks so pissed. No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. He still won't believe you, and we're trying to get some points with Chloe. So let's leave. Moving on. Swiftly. So many posters. Oh. Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. I wonder if we get this because I didn't actually look at the poster inside. Well, that's neat. She is central to the plot, so it makes sense that they're like, you no, you need to look at this poster. Oh, Rachel, rest in peace. I loved you, Will. Alright, we're gonna start off on this side, because we have to make our way back to the other side. Warren, what you want? Hi, Max, can you get my flash drive? I need some info and space. Hello? Sorry, running late, insane day. I'll meet you in the lot, looking cool. You'll see. My camera will be ready. See you shortly. I hope so. Alright, we got some more characters. I think, I think that's everybody, and let's see, there should be something new. Yeah, Michelle, Rachel was awesome. I'm so sad that the three of them never did get to hang out. It's so sad. Uh, let's see, David, Principal Wells came out. Okay, this should be a new thing. I wanted to inform Principal Wells that I saw Nathan waving a gun in the bathroom, but I didn't want to mention the girl or my new rewind abilities for obvious reasons. I wouldn't know how to tell him without making me look crazy. 
He grilled me for being out in the hall during a fire alarm. I'm still glad I didn't have to tell him that Blackwell's most big fucking deal student actually killed a girl in a previous timeline. There you go. So my school day started with an apocalyptic dream and then ended with saving a life and discovering I have some kind of power to rewind time. I don't know how to top okay, that. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. In a minute. Ah, objective. Thanks. Thanks for that. This is where we smoked when we were Chloe. So we gotta look at the cigarette. Ew, gross. At least switch to e-cigs. Alright. So there's gonna be some people for us to talk to. And a couple pictures to take. Alright, so I don't want to go this way. Who's gonna be... Oh, uh, we should do our sitting things. So bizarro to be back here after five years. Totally bizarre. I thought I could just fit right back in at school. But with all this shit going on, I'm even more an outsider. And who can I confide in besides my journal and my camera? Certain blue-haired girl. Man, these are supposed to be the best years of my life. This is what it's like to be alone and feel lonely at once. All right, Max with the deep thoughts. Hey, Ravi Vo Roy, Ra Rava Roy, <laughs> Ravi Roy. <laughs> Hi. Uh, how long I'm gonna be? Streaming for probably not very long because my throat will die. But for streaming, <laughs> which I assume is what you're trying to ask, um, I'm thinking of streaming until the end of episode one. That's the plan. So as long as, you know, things don't break anymore, that's what I'm going to try and do. Let's take a photo. Hello, Dragonfire. I finally got my stream working, so that's what's up with me. <laughs> Things are going good. All right, that's done. You, Justin. <laughs> ravioli, ravioli, give me the formioli. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to thrash? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? Bring it. What's your first move going to be? Uh, uh... Jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. What if I rewind, though? Yo, Justin. Check out the max. I came to nose slide, bruh. I came to nose slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tray flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah. <laughs> nah. I just can't skate worth shit. Aw, oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. Thank what you. What do you want to see? Uh, I need Trevor to do the tray flip so I can take a picture of him in pain. Go for a tree flip. Let's get Trevor all over that action. And... Oh, ow. Ow. Oh. You hate to see it. Just hold that pose, Trevor. Thank you. Awesome. And with that... Gonna... I'll rewind. Wow. Oh, wow. Yo, Justin. Check. I'm gonna save. Trevor I came the to pain. know. <laughs> oh, si nah. Oh. All right, do a nose slide. I'd love to see a nose slide. Let's get Trevor all over that action. I felt bad that I didn't save Trevor the pain last time. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Woo. Yeah! <laughs> He's like, yeah, I did it. Nice, nice, nice. Hey, you never really escaped Betty. <laughs> I used to be. I used to be, but I'm into my camera now. I can tell. We need more girls out here. Hell yeah. Rachel Amber and her punk friend used to skate with us. Rachel Amber used to skate too? Sweet. 
punk friend. Go on. Who was Rachel's punk friend? I can't remember her name. Justin. She was hot. How can you Tats, not remember blue her name, hair, Justin. hardcore. She stopped hanging out with us after Rachel disappeared. <laughs> oh my god, away. Justin. She used to talk to you all the time at school, man. You would steal her, um, her weed in her, in her locker all the time. You knew Rachel? She used to chill with us sometimes. But one day she just vanished. I hope she's living the dream somewhere. If anybody hurt her, we'll get a skate posse and take them out with our boards. <laughs> all right, skate posse. You ever hang out with Victoria? Fuck that. I'd rather rollerblade than hang out with snobs Ooh, like her. Let's chill later, Justin. Anytime you want to take some action shots, we're here for you, Max. Thanks, Justin. You probably won't remember we had that conversation, but I appreciate it anyway. Um, how did I miss Brooke? I'm also gonna try and get Brooke together with Warren, since we're not getting together with Warren. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Well, I was gonna just compliment you on your awesome lightsaber hoodie, but... I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon. Right? <laughs> a weapon. Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny. Warren said you were smart. Please. Step back. Ugh. Brooke. Oops. Now I'm gonna snoop on your bag. What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. <laughs> it's fine, Pats. It's fine. Hi, Brooke. Let me get. I'm sure the 16 alternate universes have nothing to do with the giant tornado. That looks at like the end. a high fly drone. Model it's B400 totally EVO. Safe. Now, that's a nice piece of tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? I love aerial photography. Drones are perfect for that, especially those with great range. It's a new era of images. Most impressive, Max. Warren said you were multifaceted. <laughs> Here. I hate to admit Get the drone whirl around campus. Whee! Flying a drone. And ah! Can you imagine if Max actually broke Brooke's drone? She'd be so angry. Oh no. Wahoo! All right, are we back around yet? <laughs> we almost ran into a guy, and that's fine. That's the wrong button. That's the right button. Thanks, Grill. Oh boy, yeah, let's talk to Hayden. Hi, Hayden. Hey, Hayden. There she is. The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Oh my gosh, Not the Vortex most. Club. Um, yeah, Vortex Club. What the hell is the Vortex Club anyway? It seems so elitist. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm not Miss Party. That's because you haven't partied with us. Or even Victoria, who's pretty funny when she's baked. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Victoria's Rachel Amber funny posters when she's not baked. <laughs> You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like, yeah. you know. 
Yeah, I mean, fair is fair, Pats. Count away. I'm curious how many alternate timelines we get started in the first episode alone. So you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked to party. <laughs> Fun to be around. Oh, yeah, and she was hot. <laughs> oh, yeah. She was in the Vortex Club? Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club? What? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us. And I'll deny I ever said that. Fair. Did Victoria like Rachel? No. <laughs> she seems like the jealous type. She did not. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. What happened to her? What do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace. Hey, that's always really so helpful. Do you want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's all right and a fun guy to hang with. Fuck the haters. <laughs> God, like it is. He seems genuinely unstable to me. Nate has his extreme moments, but don't we all? <laughs> I don't know yet, Hayden. Let's talk later, Hayden. Bye, Max. I don't no. know, Hayden. I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Always a pleasure, Hayden. And I think I can sit here. And while Max is sitting here, I'm just going to run to the bathroom quick and I'll be right back, guys. This day has been so insane. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. So there has to be a reason. And I have to find out why. Time's over, Max. I'm back. <laughs> okay. Um, Stella or Miss Grant? I guess Miss Grant. I will speak to her. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? I am actually going to break one thing here. I did sign the petition in the first game, and I thought about not signing it in this game, but... I'm trying to decide. Would, would Chloe... I think Chloe would sign for this, since she's under surveillance herself by the step douche, so... Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? Oh, 
thank David you, Madsen, North Country our chief Ladybug. of security, you wants can, to put surveillance uh, cameras all around the campus. Thank Halls, yummy Anna classrooms, for that. gym, dorm rooms, etc. That was a gift for uh, Blackwell my latest, Academy. Um, should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Video, and it's super adorable. I agree. I love it. Um, David. David Madsen doesn't need another excuse to harass students here. Max, this isn't about personalities. This is about protecting civil it's rights exactly and our schools' about personalities. Of freedom. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native yeah, Americans you. who founded this land yeah, to the pioneers yeah, who you. shared it in peace, not fear and violence. <laughs> you know a lot. You know a lot about Blackwell for being the science teacher. Science is history, Max. And I have a secret wish to teach local lore and legends. There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, <laughs> will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Yeah, I will sign. Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Miss Grant is so cool. It will have consequences. Stella, where are you, Stella? Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? I like that she knows York. Max has had to l learn like 30 people's names. You had to learn one person's name and you're just like, oh, you're that new quiet girl. Yeah, that's exactly what I was wondering, MJM. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. <laughs> it must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Uh, I'll just say no way. <laughs> no way. You can get him so busted. <laughs> and he's not going to mess around with a student. That's what you think. Dang. Now, Stella. how do you know this? <laughs> you have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Oh, well, what? I heard that from a good source. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, I'm actually gonna just say interesting. Um, interesting. See, you learn something new every day at school. Like I said, you have a lot to learn. Max, see you in class. She knows our name now. What? Hype. Um, all right, well. Daniel. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. Oh. I'm so torn about this one. Uh. So I did do it in the first one, but it's Daniel. I love Daniel. I'm gonna do this just to see what happens. If he's too sad, I'm rewinding. I'd rather not, Daniel. Not that I don't want you to. Never mind. I guess you would be too ashamed. Now, I have to get back to my drawing. No. I feel bad now. Yeah. I didn't want to hurt Daniel's feelings. I know. It's Daniel. Uh, but then, I won't see anything new if I'm Daniel's friend again. Okay, you know What's what? up, Dan? Oh. I'm not, I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna stick. I'd rather- I'm gonna stick with it. Never. I gotta be strong. I gotta be strong for episode two already as it is. I'm like, uh, I'm a terrible person. <laughs> I'm sorry, Daniel. I love you. 
Don't take it personally. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. I won't bother you. Let's talk later, okay, Max? <laughs> okay. I'll leave you to it then, my, my dude. Oh, Evan. Oh, goodness, this, this guy. I know! I feel bad about Daniel. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Oh, gosh, I can't remember. Hey, Zaynep707. Welcome, welcome. Uh, eh? uh Steve ah, McCurry? No, that's not right. Unless he could travel back in time. McCurry was born five years after the falling soldier picture. McCurry also shoots in color. In other words, no portfolio. Well, Evan, you could have at least told me what the right answer was. Sheesh. Evan's portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd love to see his photos in there. Hey, Evan. Doing good, Mind Zaynep. Mind if I check How out you your doing? cool portfolio? Let's see if you're... Robert Kappa? Robert Kappa, of okay. course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. Second time, the My, my. This quiet child knows things. <laughs> quiet That's child. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. <laughs> Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? Oh, Evan. It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honored, sir. These photos are great. And Rachel Amber's face is mesmerizing. Even when it's all blurry. So. Hi, Evan. As you can see, Rachel Amber was my favorite <laughs> model here. She knew exactly what angles worked best with my eye. You were close. Like brother and sister in arms. She understood me. Brother never and judged sister. me. Dang. I hated her vortex club click, but she never acted like she cared. Her friends were her friends. What do you think happened to her? Nothing good, Max. Nothing good. <laughs> Nothing good. All right. I think we made it, yes? We looked at everything. Well, I mean, we didn't look at everything. Who are these people? Uh, they're our fellow students. Our fellow teens, you know. You know how it is. This was a good one. Come on, Logan. Bring I like Life is Strange too, as well, but there's just something so charming about the first one. Yeah. I love the characters a lot. So many good characters. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Yes, you do. Do I have pictures to take? Is the real question. I think this is out here. Um, anything new? Get Warren's flash drive back. Saw a missing persons poster. Okay. Um, well. <laughs> we can talk to her. Yeah, let's start with her. Alyssa! Oh. Hi, Max. How are you? How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. <laughs> Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. Oh, Alyssa, I, I think you're you. better off reading chiclet. Good point. <laughs> now, if Good you'll point. excuse me. Sure thing, girl. You do you. You guys want to talk about football? No, bro. You can't take a picture. Bruh. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Bruh. No, bro. Nice, bro. <laughs> bro. Football, Max. Big football. Football, Max. Step away. Oh my gosh. You guys are the worst. Uh, bro. Bro. Glad to see our campus is eco friendly. Hi, Kate. Hi, Kate. Mm. Hey, Max. How was class? How did you like class today? Awesome. I don't remember. I guess I don't care about much of anything today. 
Is there anything? Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sweet. Sweet. Bruh. <laughs> Bro, bruh. <laughs> yeah, me, Anna. You're killing me. <laughs> nice. Those guys are having too much fun with their football. Winku, winku. You good, Sam? Howdy, Samuel. Well, hello there. <laughs> I forgot his, his voice in this one is so good. <laughs> you look busy, Samuel. Well, I'm always up to something. I'm always Today up it's to sweeping, something. You know. Then painting windows. Just don't paint over the posters for Rachel Amber. You can't color over that sunlight. You knew her? You knew Rachel? How can you know a prism? You just stare in awe. Now I have to go paint windows. Yeah, yeah, but before that... What was she like? Nice, bro. She must have been popular. Even sunlight can cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. She was like a battery. Positive and negative. Nice, bro. <laughs> you guys keep it down over there, sheesh. What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward. Like a clock. See you later, Samuel. And watch your step All around here, All the hints here, at Max. time with Samuel. After I sweep, I paint. Sweet! <laughs> you guys. Can I just, like, catch their football and throw it away and then rewind time? And I'm like, what happened to our football, bro? I don't know, bro. It's weird, bro. Bro. Dude. Bro. Oh, shit. There's Victoria and her mean girls. Yeah, Sam comes across very creepy, but he's actually a really nice guy. Oh, look. It's Max Caulfield, no. the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. Stop the Daguerrean like process, sir. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Fake laugh. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Thanks for opening up the thing, Sam. Don't mind me. Just gonna use this. It's nice when you know what to do here. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah. yeah. All over my water cashmere. Water on my cashmere? <laughs> do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. <sighs> Sam, no, I need to use the pipes. I guess I have to watch him, actually. Hang it and then come back down and then I'm like, aha, Eureka! I must loosen the handle so that it falls from thine down here and the sploosh. Sweet. Just gotta wait. Boop boop boop. Yes. Victoria is the worst. A lot of the time. Yeah. No. All right, Tam. I can't grab that. Samuel is way too close. Samuel, how did you get so close to me? Yeah. Woo! There we go. There we go. Okay, let's see if this works. Don't look at me, Sam. Just going to sabotage some things. Woohoo! And? Ooh, 
Voila. Voila. No way. No fucking you okay, way. okay, Victoria? Oh, Sam, you're sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Shoo. <laughs> hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Heck yeah. We did it. But now she looks sad. Oh man, she looks so sad and lonely sitting there alone. We doubling down though. Uh, hey Victoria. What do you want, Max? We comforted her last time. Now we're gonna make fun of her. Don't. Don't say a word, Max. Oh wait, hold that pose. <laughs> and no filter needed before I post this. Dang. Revenge now, picture. please move. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to my room. Ooh, you do that? Sassy. I know where you live. So does Nathan. Nice. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Now I have to get to my yeah, room, then see Warren. That was awesome, though. You were fierce, girl. I'm gonna sick her dog Nathan on you. Good grief. High school is an enigma. All right. Let's see. High school movie. Give me a chance to test it out. Hey, we have the picture of her in our book. <laughs> oh, that's great. All right. Still, I can't believe I took a picture of Victoria coated in paint for revenge. I must be feeling pretty brave. She vowed revenge, so I guess I've officially made my first enemy at Blackwell. Hooray! Good job, us. Okay, that's in our room. That's Victoria's room. Hurry, Courtney! You have to go through me! Victoria is going to be pissed Ow. it took so long. Rude! Shove me out of the way. Sheesh. Taylor is a slave. Blah, blah, blah. Can't go in the bathroom yet. Nope. Nope, nope. Toilet paper. Missing persons poster. Poster. Alright. We're, we're cleaning this up still. I may be doing something terrible to Kate in the next episode, but I can at least help her a little bit in the meanwhile. The universal symbol for please leave me alone, asshole. All right, we good? Pie. And straw. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Come on, draw your amazing picture, Max. I love this picture that she draws. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> Obvious, but true. On the nose, but accurate. Home sweet home, my favorite cocoon. Cocoon. Photo. Nice. Killing it with them pictures. Oh, I've got a message apparently. Hello. Hi, honey. Your principal sent me an email saying that he is concerned about your attitude and behavior, that you are not fitting in well and hiding in your dorm. I know it's hard to be away from home, even if you are all grown up now, but you are there to change the world with your camera. Please call me soon to chat. We miss you. XXOO, mommy. Mommy, you gotta use some punctuation in your text. There's like one long run-on sentence, girl. Okay, time to just relax. And you shall become a butterfly. Oh, it feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre and it feels like it has gone on forever. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Or like Poe said, a dream within a dream. Bwah. 
<laughs> I think I made that Inception joke the first time I played through this. <laughs> I can't help it, though. Okay, so we got a note. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. To Max, or whom it may concern, the cinematic contents of this flash drive are of a graphic, life-altering, controversial nature. This collection has been downloaded with the greatest care and for the most discriminating viewer. I congrat- I con- congratulate- I- I congratulate you on your taste, and eagerly await your in-depth reviews of Cannibal Holocaust and Ultra Vixens. Peace, Warren G. The real Warren G. Oh, Photos, Teddy. Drawer. <sighs> Max and Chloe, hey. best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Yeah, about that. <laughs> okay, let's see. Photos, photo album, sticky note, instant film. Am I gonna let Lisa die this time? Yeah, I think I will let Lisa die this time. <laughs> I haven't forgotten you, little Lisa. Yet. Sorry, Lisa. I look so pathetic. <laughs> Hipster alert! Aw, oh, instead of a nice picture by Daniel, we got this bark. I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. A friend and an enemy. Nice. Sticky note. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Hey girl, I borrowed your drive so I can watch some flicks while I study. If you need it back, just track me down in my room. XOXOD. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Great. That's a great map, by the way. By the by, cookies. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. I am kind of going to be a meanie just because I was very nice in my first playthrough and I want to I want to see what differences there are. And if I'm going to pick opposite choices to what I did last time that necessitates me being a meanie kind of Unfortunately. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rotten there. Oof. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Let me out, Julianne. This is so stupid. I'm mainly going to be focusing on doing Answer stuff that what? Chloe approves of. So take that as you will. Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked you Dana in the room because we're cool. Um... What did she... She's your friend. She's your friend. Friends don't sex with their best totally friend's boyfriend. No, probably not. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? <laughs> Watson. Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Of course I do. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I don't care. So, how did you find out about Why them? Why do I remember her According last to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Oh. Huh. She saw the sex, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything. But I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. I'm on it, girl. On it. Ninja time. All right. First things first. Let's play a little photo Tetris and leave Victoria a message. Let's move this here. And this one there. Hmm, a pattern is emerging. Get the double revenge today. Last time I reversed time and fixed it. But this time I won't. I'm just gonna leave that there for Victoria when she gets back. Alright. Do, 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 TV. 
be Lizette, ba ba ba. Photo, sticker, jewelry. I think that's what I need. Oh, yeah. Victoria hates Rachel Amber this much? How insecure. Um, this is semi-blind, Emma. I've played through the entire game before, but I saved Arcadia Bay instead of Chloe. So this time I'm going through and picking Chloe positive options as well as some alternate options to what I did last time. So yeah. Semi-blind is the answer. That's real nice, Victoria. And who the hell thinks I'm a hipster? Everyone. Boom. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Okay. La print. Okay. Do, 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 do. I don't know why it's you didn't better take a picture of it Juliet with your that phone instead innocent. of printing it, but sure. That's fine. Hey, Juliet. Juliet, read this. Of course. <laughs> I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. <laughs> Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's yeah. see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. I love Dana. She's so sweet. I may be sabotaging my relationship Almost done. with her, though. Get the flash drive, and then I'll go see Warren. I may. We'll see. We will see. Yeah. If I touch that, oh, trouble. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. I forgot about that. It's so funny. Of course a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. It's so fascinating to get a peek into Dana's social media world. And yes, Max, so terribly wrong. I never noticed that Trevor was uh, messaging her before, I don't think. Cute. And a flash drive. I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. Unholy obscenities. All right. Um... This is both sad and pathetic. Oh, Logan. Can I talk to you before I ruin stuff? Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. I know, I love that in this game, most, most people don't care that you're looking through their stuff, using their computers, reading their personal letters. They're just like, eh, it's fine. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. Pardon? Here we go. The best, uh, friend zone line you can say. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. And in a special folder called Max. Wow. Yeah, okay. I yeah, gotcha. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's good. Okay, so now here we go. <laughs> this is the worst. Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. <laughs> Whoops. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. Yep. 
But I could rewind and make it up to her. Oh, she's so sad. She won't let me look at this either. There's no more gossip for you here, Max. So go. A maternity book? I said, please go. Oh, gosh. I feel terrible. Uh, committing. Uh, I'm a terrible person. Uh... I don't mind waiting out here forever. I love this parking lot. I can count all the cars. The more I tax, the longer I take. On my way. Bye. Sorry, Dana. I love you. I love you, and I love Daniel, and I love Kate, and I'm gonna be a terrible person. Huh? They're all gonna die at the end of this anyway, right? So I don't need to feel guilty. That's how that works. This shit. Oh. Ow! Whoa. That hurt. Damn, I better rewind. <laughs> okay. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's I what I'm know. talking about. I, feel terrible. I actually helped somebody. Uh, hi, Victoria. Well, yummy Anna. You know about me and my morbid curiosity, right? <laughs> I need to know how things change. <laughs> She's dead. I'm sorry. This is, this is practice for that. Me being terrible to all these people is practice for that. Oh, I'm going to feel absolutely horrible. I already do. Hi, ho, I hope you enjoyed the pick. It's your last one. Blech. Uh, let's see. More high school drama. I know, I'm sorry. Felt like a weasel. Um, she was in a weird mood, so I had to look around to see if I could find out why. I found a home pregnancy test along with a note from Logan at a doctor's appointment. Dana admitted she was pregnant, and I realized that all of my friends have troubles that are just as significant as mine. I don't think Dana admitted that she was pregnant. I think she told you to get the heck out of her room and her life. Okay. So, I need to take this picture. True, all caps mean she's like yelling at you, basically. Alright. We're saving you this one time, Alyssa, because we needed a picture out of it. Max, that was awesome. Thank you. That was close. That was close. Jock assholes. If I was a member of the Vortex Club, they'd never pull that. Would you want to be a member? They're smart. <laughs> we should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid book. Stupid book. Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. I'm not looking for any interviews. I think we're done, yes? Yes. What's the next picture? That's later. That's also later. This one's the next, I think? I can't remember the specifics for that. Oh, that's in the parking lot. Yeah, right. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm <laughs> the saying? Squinty eyes. Oh, and mm. leave me alone. What's happening over there? All right, this time we're taking the photo, I'm not intervening. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. <laughs> So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Sorry, Kate. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. Nobody likes me. Sad face. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over the line. I could rewind and try something different. No, we've 
kind of rewound already by doing this, so here we go! Committing! We're a terrible person. Try to be nice when I can, but I was too nice my first time through. Doesn't give me a lot of options for this time around. Unfortunately. Man, I should have done something. That guy was an asshole. Hey, we got a picture. Nice. What the fluff? Trying to get the hang of this whole rewind thing. Helped Alyssa. I also saw David Madsen hassling Kate Marsh. I couldn't hear everything, but he accused her of something. All that guy can do is point fingers, and I got so pissed. He's a security guard, not a stormtrooper. But like the chicken shit I can be, I didn't go over and stand up for her. I was scared. Sometimes I still feel like a little kid. And yes, Kate was not happy. I didn't come over to stand by her. So I let her down, and my rewind power was useless. But we have a picture for later. I don't get it. How could Zack and Victoria do that to me? It's true. Max doesn't deserve friends this time around. Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? And hello, Ruby Girl oh, 2004. Hey, Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Nice to see ya. Um, sorry. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Have you talked to Zach yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexted Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren wants your attention. He usually does. <laughs> Hang in there, Juliet. Savage. See you around, Max. All right. Smoke hippies? Is that what that says? Cars equals death. TP bike. What asshole parked like this? Look at this. Right in the handicapped. Terrible person. Damn, somebody is seriously devoted to putting up these posters. Aw, thank you, Ruby Girl! That means a lot. I'm glad that you like the video so much. Now this really pisses me off. So entitled. Sorry, handicapped folks. My truck needs these two spots more than you do. Bastard. Dang. Calling out Chloe like that? <laughs> See Max in high school, and she is not popular. <laughs> Very true. It's Pompadou! Pompadou, were you here last time? That dog looks peaceful asleep, but if I get too close, Cujo. I don't remember Pompadou being there last time. Pompadou! It's not a dirty window unless somebody writes clean me on it. I could use this picture for a series on Arcadia Bay Lots. Alright. Only two more to go. Nice. I think. We can go Yo, talk to Warren. Max, check it out. Hey. What up, Max? Ready for How the are you? hug? Here's your flash. Thanks. Ah. No problem. Whoops. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now year. we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? Uh, it's been one strange fucking day. Man, I saw that Victoria didn't take down that pic of you on Facebook. Major bitch move. On Facebook? Eh. I know, the awkward hug gets me every time. No worries, Warren. I took a sweet shot of Victoria I can't wait to share. 
Oh, score one for Team Max. Yeah. It would be so karmic to see her ass clown face all over the interwebs. Ass clown face. I guess she does deserve it for all the shitty things she's done to people here. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? I think I'll do this one this time. No, I've been way too busy with class and life. Damn, girl, you had it like a year. <laughs> or a week. I did browse through all the titles, Drama Queen. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. No fucking way will I watch that. My mind is twisted enough. <laughs> I laughed my ass off. So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. Hey, I laughed my ass off, so you're sensitive. How so? Sensitive usually means won't be having sex with you. Oh, you got a God. winner. You need a sensitive woman to kick your ass. <laughs> if I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. Wow. But you seem Straight distracted. Upset it. Yeah, I won't talk to you about it this time. I don't want to speak about it. This is kind of a crazy day for me. I mean, I literally think I'm going crazy. I may be a pest, but I'm a good listener. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me. <laughs> I don't want to talk. Not social media. Max is like, I need to tell don't him anyway, me. though. Max, go I on. I need to tell him. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I know, this conversation's great. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? Why are you coming after me? You're I didn't one of the say Jefferson's anything. photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you saw, now. Answer me, bitch. Um, what are you talking about, dude? What are you talking about? I know you're new here, but don't even play stupid with me. I'm not new. I've lived here for years. Got him. Then you should know the Prescotts own this shithole. Then you don't have to worry about me. Worry about yourself. Ooh. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Take a step back. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! <laughs> Leave him alone! Nobody my tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Bring in the down. bathroom! <gasps> Ooh, the scratch! Good job, girl. Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Warren. Go! Go! I got this! Get in, Max! I know. Get it's the amazing the out of there time. now! Don't so even good. try to run! Nobody messes with me! Nobody! Cruise back together, baby. Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. <laughs> After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? No idea. I have no idea. I know he's a Prescott. And an asshole. Your friend really stood up for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. <laughs> I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? No. No, it felt like a real city for artists. Big and bright. Great for taking pictures. Yeah, must be hard coming back to a hick town like hey, Arcadia Daniel. again. Hey, Daniel! Not after nice seeing you. Nice to see you. Glad you Please, can make girl. it for a little bit. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Um, I'm streaming until the end of this episode, episode one. So, I'm getting close. Probably like another hour-ish? Something like that? Depends how long it takes me to to go. Only for Mark Jefferson. He was a pretty famous photographer in the 90s. 
I've always loved his work. Those that can't do, teach. I'm glad you found a good reason to come back. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Hmm. Which one should I do? This is an important decision. Not to say I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliché geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. Eesh. Rough. We'll get on our good side soon enough. Make some moves. I'll make it up to you, girl, I promise. Broken? Oh, man, are you serial? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. <laughs> my step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it in my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Nerd alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually All is right, a tiny All right, sounds good, Daniel. Thanks for stopping by Welcome for a couple home, minutes anyway. I'm glad you are able to make it for a little bit. And you can probably skip like the first 10 to 20 minutes of the stream, Daniel, because I had some issues with getting the game working. <laughs> had to restart it a couple of times. Eventually got it. Come on in, don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. Ah, uh, good to see this room again. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. <laughs> it's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. The music. I know memories. So tell me, what does Max Caulfield do for fun now that she's a grown up? Um. <laughs> you know, party all night. Party all night. Not little Miss Wallflower. I bet you've never even been to a party. Oh, right. I went to your birthday blowout. Max, you were 12 years old. That's sad. <laughs> you should stick to taking photos. me out. Oh, I wasn't floundering a bit, Daniel. I was hardcore floundering. <laughs> so tell me, what if- I take pictures. I take photos of me, the world, everything. It may sound sad, but I have a blast. It doesn't sound that sad. I'm happiest when I've got a great image in my lens. I'm not lonely, not afraid. Now that's more inspiring. I don't feel so totally hopeless. Hooray! We did it. The closet to hide inside. Um, I won't break her snow globe. We had such, such a blast time. drawing these together. Yeah, most people are high in this game, MJM. <laughs> Most are, funnily enough. Look at that. Chloe and her dad were so close. Nice. All right, power strip. Boop. Nice. We have the power. Uh. She looks super happy. She looks super sad. 
She looks super stoned. Worth it. I think this junk swallowed her discs. <laughs> So it was Chloe who printed all those flyers. Yep, it was. Who'd have thought Chloe wouldn't pay her parking tickets? <laughs> she does love trouble. She does. She also draws butterflies. With a blue pen. Mm. All right, just getting some, some background info on Chloe. Chloe totally changed her style. <laughs> Super mad. I That's just her normal her. face. <laughs> Chloe was always taller than me. We made her dad keep track of her height. Dad is gone. That's so sad. Nothing but junk in this suitcase. All right, girl. Let's get that disc. The butterflies. <laughs> hey, give me that. Sorry, I wasn't trying to be nosy. Obviously, it's she just was natural a good for friend. me to be nosy. It's putting it mildly. All right. See you later, Daniel. Hope the rest of your work goes good and uh, i'll see you later thanks for stopping by for a little bit i will have fun that's rachel amber her missing person posters are all over blackwell yeah i put them up she was my angel after my dad died and you moved i felt abandoned rachel saved my life man i had no idea well you never made much effort to find out Damn. i was 14 we were best friends I never forgot, even if I was an asshole and didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. You would laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. So what happened? So what happened? Did your folks, your mom, try to stop you? My mom was too busy hooked up with Sergeant Shithead. I feel the love. Now, when did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Oh, thank Without you, a Ruby word. girl. I'm glad you like Without my subby voice. <laughs> what about her parents? Are they looking for her? They're in denial. Max, I know she's missing. I assume you know more than that. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. And you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you, and Rachel. Gone. Can you put on some music now? Okay. I can do that.
cool, Max. You could have helped me out. Sorry, Kate. I chickened out. Oh, no. It's like the dog from Desperado. It's all over again. No! Don't bring out the dog. I tried to save that dog. I swear, man. I swear I did. Let's see. Nathan Prescott freaked out. Even though I was scared, I was more furious. And it was Chloe. Let's see. We sat like strangers. <laughs> An exploded version of her new adult self, yeah. Chloe's obsessed with Rachel. Yeah, okay. Nothing really changed there. I haven't seen this place in five years. Seems like forever. Told me he saw you near that garbage dump. Now I've ordered you. Told you. Ordered to stay away from that place. It's dangerous. And you got no idea what kind of scum are living out there. Stay away. Serious. I'm serious. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Okay. Lights. Why would you need to turn the light switch on? Just because you can? How odd. Joy still works at Two Wells Diner. Best damn burgers in Arcadia. I better get one soon. Hey, Tess! You made it! Welcome! I'm so glad you could make it. Yeah, I've been going for two hours now, just about. Pretty crazy. The sliding door. I don't know if I need anything out there. I can feel autumn pushing out to summer. Ah, another sitting thing. Okay, awesome. I'm gonna use that as another opportunity to use the washroom. Dang those two cups of coffee, so I'll be right back. What do you truly want to do when you grow up? Max, I'm already grown up. What about you? Travel. That would be awesome. Explore the world, go far from here. Far from me? Thanks a lot, dude. Dude, you would totally come with me. I need a bodyguard for our adventures. I would be like Lara Croft, except real. That would be majorly cool. Totally. We'd have cars and boats and planes all over for instant escape. And no adults could tell us what to do. Count me in. What would you do while I was bodyguarding you? Maybe take pictures of our adventures. I would love to be a photographer. As if I ever could be. What are you talking about? Max, you are a photographer. Your pictures could be in a museum. Someday they will. I believe in you. again i plan to stream again next saturday at the same time actually right now with my work friday evenings and saturday afternoons are kind of the best times at the moment so that's the plan 
It is next Saturday at 2. should work out again. Um, and Tess, have I had any technical difficulties today? Ha, ha, ha. Well. <laughs> yes. Come on, open it, chicken. Is the answer. Hold on. And I'm not chicken. <laughs> it took me a Proven. while. You drink first, Max. There was something really no worked way. with the, um, it was your idea, with being Chloe. able to pick choices in Whatever. the game. So it took a Give little bit bottle. of time. I had to restart. Well, fiddle, tasty. But I eventually got it figured out. Very tasty. Here, I, I want to sit. And everybody was very patient, which Sorry, was much appreciated. Sorry, this is not the kids. Don't be greedy. Give me some. Oh shit, the carpet. There's wine all over. What do we do now? My parents are coming. Cover it up. <laughs> yes, you did jinx me, Tess. How, how could you? I thought we were friends. <laughs> Nah, it was all good. It wasn't too bad as far as issues go. It could have been like a lot worse, so. Hey, I remember that stain. Chloe and I knocked over Joyce's wine bottle and we scrubbed forever, but it never came out. We got so busted. All right. I should be able to find the tools I need here. Should. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? I would hope you're sorry, Tess. <laughs> you promised me. You promised me. Ah. <laughs> Chloe's stepfather is this asshole from Blackwell? I'm just kidding. It's You've got to be shitting me. It really wasn't too bad. Yeah, right. If I was able to fix it without uh, Hubby being here, then it wasn't so bad at all. <laughs> he wasn't here, by the way. He went for a walk, and I'm like, oh, of course, I'm by myself, my first stream. What could go Ooh, wrong? precision screwdrivers. Except I can't I reach it them. It was all good. Wowzer, a map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. Oh yeah, David is definitely a good good guy. Uh oh, okay, Kara. Thank you for joining as long as you were able to. It was nice to have you. Have a good rest what of your day. Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For reals? This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? I will tell them. What happens if you... I gotta know. If I just leave it open, what happens? I'm gonna leave it open and see what happens. No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway. No password. Okay. Like it would help me find I tools anyway. I can't remember anyway. if we could actually go into his computer. I can't remember. Uh, I wonder what's in those files up there. Shit! Butterfingers! Kate Marsh? Why the hell would he have pictures of her? Okay, this is getting totally weird. Um, well, part of it was he went for a walk with his mom, and his mom had a hair appointment very soon after I was streaming, so they didn't have a lot of time. And the second reason is I think he uh, had more confidence in me than I had in myself, and my level of confidence was actually accurate because I did need him in the end. So bleh. <laughs> it was just unlucky. All right, so I ruined his files. I left his thing open. I'm so curious what's gonna happen now. <laughs> it's gonna be like, who the heck was in my garage? Ugh. But 
He might yell at Chloe. I don't want to get Chloe in trouble, actually. This might get Chloe in trouble. I don't want to get her in trouble. She's already mad enough at me as it is. Close. <laughs> yeah, I was worried he was going to murder me, so that's why I'm like, oh, you know what? I might just fix all that. Yeah. That was very yeah. smart, dumbass. No can reach. I got you guys. Yeah, I would hope my hubby wouldn't murder me for him not being here. Sheesh. <laughs> Wait a minute. I was the one that needed help. Why are you murdering me? Um, yeah. As I was doing that, like, you know what? Chloe's probably going to be in a lot of trouble if I just leave it like that. So I'm just going to not do that. And if I want to satisfy that particular bit of curiosity, I'm going to uh, look it up somewhere. Lepul? Yes! You have mad skills, Max. Yay, Mad Max. We did it. I've got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. She's bacon. She's not gonna freak out. It's totally fine. All right. We are back, girl. Hello? You found the tools. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. Well. All right. I'm fixing my camera. <laughs> so? I can't fix this thing. <laughs> Are these your new photos? Yeah, I just took them today. Let me see. Booyah, you skank. Karma's <laughs> a bitch. Nice framing, too. Thank you, Are you Chloe. shitting me? That asshole's everywhere. You skank. <laughs> I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. Oh, you were stuck on the it tools. It totally but, makes sense. Uh, that's fair. You hella saved my life. It is a little now bit Now tell tricky. me the truth, Max. I was there. I was there, hiding in the corner. Damn, you are a ninja. <laughs> a ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. <laughs> I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? Yeah, that's like me. I'm too impatient. I'm like, it's not working. Everything's just... It's just not gonna work. I give up. I wasn't sure. I know I look a lot different. I was scared, too. I, I couldn't see straight. I don't blame you, Max. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. Just a bit? There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. I only now heard for the all big of question. This. Did you tell anybody? No. No, I didn't know what to do. I don't blame you. That's some intense shit. Maybe I should go to the principal. The principal? Are you still 12? <laughs> that drunk jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. Okay. Seriously, I, that I didn't blab to anybody. Promise. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. Oh. So on that note, I uh, my dad's camera. know it was your birthday last month. thing for her to give this was my her, real father's camera his dad, her dad's i camera. want you to have it that's so cool you remembered my birthday but i can't take this of course you can my dad would be pissed if i never used it and now i know it'll be used awesomely and i'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion cool yes of course it's cool 
Thank you. <laughs> this camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way. <laughs> I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take I can't my wait picture to see new camera. Dance again. So good. <laughs> Take a picture. Nice. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Come on, Max. Back out, girl. Come on. Come on. Yes. Yeah. Break it down, Max. There we go. <laughs> I love that dance. <laughs> Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. How many times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Dude, the music's not even on. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, on it, girl. What's going on? Open this door, please. Chill. I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. Yep. Chloe. I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just let me in now. All right. One Let's second. My rear line that. Ba -doop. Whoa. Chloe. I'm coming. What are you doing? Move. Chloe, you're stalling. Yeah. I'm changing. Give me a minute. <laughs> Moves it over like smart. half an Just inch. Let me in now, please. One yeah. second. My bra is stuck. I'm not screwing around. So shit. What's going on in here? Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat. We'll do that to you. One of my guns is missing. He doesn't like people being in Did his house without Did you take it? Oh, God, I didn't take it. your stupid gun. You and he's also gun got control. a leap with Max already. Is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. Whose is it? And yes, you are meant to shake Polaroid pictures. That's how you get them to develop. It's so that you don't have to... Instead of taking film to a black, uh, to a dark room to develop it that way, you can take an instant photo and then shake it, and that develops it. It's pretty cool. Step in. I'm sorry. That was my joint. Well, well. Yeah. I don't like strangers in my home. Don't like strangers. Especially dopers. So you're bringing drugs into my home. How about if I call the police? That'd screw up your spotless Blackwell record. Ugh. You do seem to get around, Max. I'm sick of you losers dragging Chloe down. Oh, you're on a roll today. Between the fire alarm and now this, you don't have anything smart to say now, do you? Get the huh? hell away from her. I have proof you hassled Kate Marsh today. What? What are you talking about? Yeah. I have surveillance proof. Surveillance. Now please leave us alone. Okay, Chloe, you know everything. And Max, <laughs> if I find you here again, it will be the last time. You know everything. <laughs> because you're such a badass, Max, let me show uh, you my new toy. I'm Price. Chloe Price. Bang! Jesus, put that thing down. Jesus. Relax, sister. It's not even loaded. Yet. I thought you believed in gun control. Yes, I believe I should control the gun. It's the men who need to be checked. You trust hey. Nathan or David? Thanks for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no match for you and me now. That was an epic win. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hick hole. Man, that did not go well for me. What well if for I her. want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody, even Chloe. I have to think about my own future. Nah, girl, we here for the Chloe today. I know that I did that the first time I played through, but I remember Chloe being really happy about that outcome. You're so. giving me a look I haven't seen for a while. <laughs> What's the problem? <laughs> Put it back. Why steal a gun from your stepdad? You know you're going to get busted. Or somebody like Nathan will bust me with a cap. Screw that. I need to cover my own back. Your stepdad won't let you off the hook that easy. What the hell does he need another gun for? To mow down Bigfoot cheerleaders? 
This is all just so scary. I know, Max, but I do feel safer having a 9mm in my pants. <laughs> Can you use it? Can you actually use it? After about a hundred online videos? Hell you yeah. Videos. Just don't keep it in your pants, okay? <laughs> Max, I'm yeah. not looking for trouble. I just want protection. If anybody in this country should have guns, it should be women. Interesting. All right, and on that note, out we go. Yeah, and Tess, I mean, David's a very complicated character. He, he absolutely treats Chloe horribly. But the motivations are good. Like, he's very, he's a very complicated character. I did end up really liking him in the end. He's trying to do the right things, but because of what he went through with the war, it's messed him up big time. So I do feel badly for him. And no problem, Ruby girl. Go get Isn't yourself some awesome hot cocoa sauce? in a sandwich. Totally reminds me of when we were kids. That does sound really good, actually. Come on, slowpoke. Hold on. It's a good day for hot cocoa. I haven't been here in forever. So why do I feel like I was just here? Oh, it wasn't such a nice This day is the exact then. same path I was on during my nightmare today. Yeah. Isn't that strange? Hello, cute little squirrel. You and me. Stare contest. I win. Do-do-do-do. I got you. <laughs> I got you, bird. All right, one more to go. Let's see. Let's see, paranoia. Close on the butterfly photo. Me to shake my booty just a bit. Had to hide in the closet. Said it was my weed. David tried to threaten me. Chloe was awesome and threatened him. Chloe was so touched I took the blame. Uh, we decided to get out of there and catch up on our exploring like best friends. Burp. Burp. Is there anything else to look at? That old fence is part of the landscape now. The path behind it leads to the parking lot. Okay. I don't think I need to look at anything here either. I'll be looking at a lot more things in uh, the second episode. Because more stuff should have changed by then. Not so much this. I don't think... If I'm wrong, I apologize, but I don't think. Warren? Hey! <laughs> Keck. Earth to Max, your white knight, Warren here. I know you were worried about me. I owe you. Thanks for today. Call back later, Kay, I swear. No prob, and you still have to tell me your big secret. Keck. Nibber. Birds are so lucky, they can always escape. Unless they fly into a window. <laughs> Too soon. Oh my god, I forgot all about this. Too bad I can't rewind that far back. <laughs> the cairn. I don't remember this at all, but it seems like it's been here for a long time. Mean. Weird. Those glyphs remind me of the wind. Footprints, all kinds of strange stuff around here. Bigfoot. I think this is associated with a memory. Too bad it's locked. Yeah. I remember racing up and down the steps. Trust no one. Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. 
I never made it. Alright, so now I need to take a picture. And that should be all the pictures again. Hooray! All right, girl. Talk to me. I don't think I can go up here, right? Nope, that seagull is safe from me. You sure you don't want to be alone? Have a seat, Pete. <laughs> You're in a good mood. You're in a good mood? Seeing my step dork get played makes me happy. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. Glad I took his photo. I'm glad I took his photo with Kate. Just in case. Why was he all up in her shit? He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. <laughs> Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? Well, yeah. Well, yeah. I couldn't help it. Never change. What did you find? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Oh, boat. Other Blackwall students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's at war or something. He's a total surveillance fetish. I worry there's spy cams in the house. I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it! He is so hella fucking paranoid! I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. Alright, no problem, Catherine. I think I'm almost done with the live stream anyway. Thank you for sticking around so long. You were here for almost the entire thing. I'm glad that you were able to come. Hope you have a good rest of your weekend. Even yours? Not anymore. So what do you have on Nathan? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. How much? How much do you owe? Three grand plus interest. And before I could get a chunk of that from Nathan, he dosed my drink with some shit. God, Chloe, I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. Chloe, that is so fucked up. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. He's still dangerous. He's still dangerous, Chloe. Not just to you. Good thing you didn't tell anyone. <laughs> Nathan Prescott better watch his back now. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. Destiny. <laughs> yeah, girl. If this is Destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. This shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. Oh no. 
going under. Oh no! Not again! Why is this happening to me? Why? If only Why I had a spirit again? deer to help me. Oh. Hey look, a spirit deer. Find out. I'm trying. Why won't... Hello. For some reason, my right hand, my right mouse button is not working. So I have to keep pressing control. Read this newspaper. Let me read it. God. October 11th? Ooh, is this Friday? That's only four days away. That's right, Lighthouse. You can't fall on me when I'm reading oh, newspaper. No. That tornado is headed straight for the town. Chloe, you're here. I'm back. Oh my lord, this is real, it's real. Oh man, this sucks. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just zoned. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. Bye-bye, town. <laughs> there's something else I have to tell you. It's coming. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But hi, right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. Stop trying to get me high. Creep. Schnurr. What the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. All right, so we begin once again. Oh, by the way, David, there's a broken window in your bedroom. You might want to fix that. Oh, 
Ruby Girl, that sounds so good. I want hot cocoa with marshmallows. Yum, yum. I love that Nathan's the only one who doesn't care that it's snowing right now. Everyone's like, is that snow? Nathan's like, I took some great pictures today. Rachel! Yay! We did it! Episode one! Ooh, peppermint hot chocolate sounds good. <laughs> 25 timelines. Awesome. Go get yourself some noms, Pats. Fireworks are going off outside, MJM? On this, the 14th of November? The heck? All right, so I hit the truth. I made fun of Victoria. I took a photo of David harassing Kate. And this is the only one where I was kind of close to majority. Good job, me. I was in the majority of not letting Daniel draw my portrait. M minority of signing the petition. Majority of helping Alyssa because I needed a picture. Um, minority of erasing the insult. Interesting. Minority of watering the plant or not watering the plant, very, very low minority of touching the pregnancy test and making Dana super sad. I didn't have to do that, but I kind of wanted to know. Um, Chelslyn, I'm doing mostly opposites. Some things I'm doing the same. Like I did the, I handled the whole hiding in the closet thing, the same with Chloe. Um, I still helped Alyssa. Like stuff that kind of leads to positive Chloe points for lack of a better term I'm doing and if it leads to a picture I'm also doing that but like for instance I touched Dana's pregnancy test and then didn't rewind time I'm not watering my plants so my plants probably gonna die uh the big thing at the end of episode two is gonna be an opposite choice <laughs> not looking forward to that not really um, I reorganized Victoria's photos. Yes, I did. Minority. Minority. Majority let the bird die. Terrible. I was not going to break Chloe's snow globe. Um, didn't leave any evidence because I was worried that David would do something to Chloe. And I read David's files. All right. So it begins many times Chloe almost gets killed. <laughs> but that'll be next time because we're done. We are done episode one of Life is Strange season one and the first stream today. So it's time to wrap up, guys. Thank you very much, all of you, for joining, even if it was just to come in and say hi quickly. I really appreciate it. Uh, I'm so glad it went well-ish for the most part. I mean, it was just the beginning, really. Everything went smoothly after that. So thank you for the patience and the chatting and everything, guys. It was fun. It was a lot, a lot of fun. Um, so the plan is... I know it felt short, but it was, it's like two and a half hours. <laughs> Oh, uh, thank you guys! Thank you! We did it! Yay! <laughs> I can stream! Uh, well, I'm planning to do episode 2 next Saturday at the same time. So, yeah, if you guys would like to join for another stream, I'll hopefully see you next week. Of course, I've got all the normie stuff coming out this week. Uh, finishing up Edo Blossoms, the Treasure Box DLC, and then Jihyo, and I think, to, actually tomorrow, um, I get my first ending in blank space, so that's pretty exciting, so, yeah, got some good stuff coming up in between, but, uh, yeah, hopefully I'll see you next week, 
Thank you, Yummy Anna, for the congrats. <laughs> and yeah, I mean, after we're done Life is Strange, I'm definitely gonna look into what else to stream after. Maybe do some, some um, like a game that everyone in the community can play, like take turns or something. That would be fun. Definitely gonna look into it, for sure. This is Babu's first stream. <laughs> so I'm just like dipping my toes, which is why I'm playing something kind of familiar, so it's not too, too new, just starting off, but. Yeah, anyway, thanks again, guys. I hope you have a good rest of your day, good rest of your weekend, and uh, I will see you later. Okay, bye now. Oh no, I was just about to end the stream and then Chelson donated. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you rock, Molly. Also said my name right. Good job. Aw, <laughs> oh, thank you so much for the donation. A fir first donation on the first stream. That's so kind. <laughs> I had to say thank you at the very least. Thank you. Now bye, everybody. Bye.